What's up, YouTube? Just doing another little impromptu update on the FC09 Swap Grom. Got a couple more things done. Have the fairings on that I'm going to run. Primal Graphics did uh, the graphics kit on this. Racing Bros Suspension is the ones who kind of sent out their suspension kit to run on this bike, doing the forks, and this is their newer-ish rear shock for the 22 and up Grom. That is, uh, I believe it's out now, but it was a unreleased spring rate. It's a 175 instead of like the 130 is the highest you could go. And I think this is going to work out great. But uh, anyhow, the next thing I'm doing on, on kind of the checklist on this thing is getting the fuel tank done. So what we're doing here is running an external tank in the swing arm. Yes, this is a fire extinguisher bottle that I cut the bottom out cut the top off I'm gonna weld on my own fittings I believe this should hold a gallon and a half maybe closer to a gallon and three quarters but uh, yeah essentially this is gonna be an external tank I'll have my main tank up there where you fill it there it'll be parts and pieces and things added to the main tank to hold maybe a half gallon to three quarters of a gallon up there and then I will have a transfer line that gravity feeds into this tank and at the bottom of this tank will be the factory FC09 fuel hat and fuel pump. So sticking with all the stock components that go with this engine. Um, I did this on the R R7 Swap Grom. It worked out really well. Only issue I had was my transfer line started leaking up in Tennessee when we were doing the tail of the dragon. I kind of remedied that on that uh, on the R7 build by doing a stainless braided line. And we're going to skip all that go straight to the stainless braided line on here but yeah this is uh coming together the primal graphics kit looks great um i believe this is the first time i've really had this out in the sun and wasn't too happy with the colors on the primal kit but man it is it just pops in the sun i think we may do something else with the graphics i'm gonna try to work with those guys some more but it came out better than i had anticipated especially in the sun so next kind of thing to do is finish off that fuel tank and kind of finish off the radiator bits i do have the radiator hoses figured out sorry guys this is kind of just impromptu going through what i've done so far so the radiators this is a r7 2024 r7 radiator and i do have a actual radiator hose that's up into the factory fitting at the top of the radiator and then down here kind of have it just about figured out lighting's not very good but just about have that radiator hose figured out i have a fitting for that that i need to install and then on this side all it is is the factory fc09 radiator hose that's kind of cut down a little bit so we can make this turn but yeah this thing is is turning out i had to put everything together and kind of get it out in the sunlight just to gain some motivation sometimes that's how it goes with these projects you see them unfinished for so long that really an end in sight doesn't uh doesn't push you to get out and, and get after stuff so take took about 15 minutes to put this together and push it outside i think i think i'll be getting after it now so here we go time to finish up that tank i suppose i could show you that the lighting's not going to be great but all it is is some eighth inch steel that's kind of curved around the actual tank welds it to the tank just to support a c channel angle iron that has a bolt that goes through it same deal on that side bolt that goes through it it's just eighth inch plate steel that's welded to the swing arm that kind of extends out so that that c channel can sit into it and then I'll, i'm gonna make a mount in the front so this thing doesn't tip back and forth i am super close on my shock reservoir i do have some space to work with that's why the front mount is going to get put in there but yeah hopefully hopefully the goal is to run hopefully two two or more gallons of fuel on this setup just so i can do the tail of the dragon and you know make it to the top fill up be able to come back down and uh fill up at the base but yeah we're gonna get after it y'all take it easy